Welcome to the concluding act of Wearable Art 2021 Intergalactic. This has been an amazing journey, I have to say. I want to especially thank our major sponsors, Alaska Airlines, KTOO, Salon Cedar, and all the community partners who shared in making this work. George Grass for his beautiful guitar. We'll find out who's going to win that here in a moment. All of you who bought things on the auction, thank you so much for doing that. And please plan to come and pick your items up tomorrow between 10 and 6 or Tuesday. Is that the wrong time? It's 2 to 6 on, on Monday and 10 to 6 on Tuesday. From the back. <laughs> we had 2 to 6 on Monday and 10 to 5 on Friday, on Tuesday. So Monday, Tuesday. Come to Centennial Hall. We'll have your items wet, ready and waiting. And now I would like to bring Kathleen Harper up. She has been the production manager. Without her assistance, this de thing definitely would not have launched. It would not have gotten anywhere. We'd still be on the ground. Kathleen, can you come and tell us who wins ground control? A highly competitive event. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, thank you, Nancy, so very much. Um, so this year we added a fun event with a lot of great community partners, and that was the Ground Control Scavenger Hunt. Participants competed to gain points around town and in our online platform to get points and come out as winners of prizes and glory. So in first place for the Ground Control Scavenger Hunt, we have Amy Dressel. Yay! Amy got 400 points by the end and will win a $100, $100 and a wearable art intergalactic mask and koozie. Our second place is Mike Inwood. Yay! Mike got 355 points by the end of the scavenger hunt and will win $50 and a wearable art intergalactic mask. And in third place, we have Gina Varney. Woo! Gina came in with 110 points and wins $25 and a wearable art intergalactic koozie. Uh, congratulations to our scavenger hunt winners and a huge thank you to all of the partners and businesses in town who were locations or participated in some way. You made it awesome. Thanks, everyone. And now we'd like to bring up Adelaide and Margot Youngberg, as well as Karen Crane, to do our raffle draws for the Degress guitar as well as the Alaska Airlines raffle. Ooh, so which one are we doing first? first? Guitar, guitar first. Guitar! Okay. Swirl it around. Swirl it. Make it a good one. All right, let's look together. <laughs> and the winner is Dirk Younger. <laughs> That's really what it does. Hilarious. Awesome. Okay. All right. Give it a really good swirl now. <laughs> Epic swirl. Keep those eyes up in the air. No looking. Swirling. Okay. I believe that this says, I want to confirm with someone else, but I believe the winner of the Alaskan Airlines tickets is Tanya Bliss. Woo! Awesome job, Tanya and Dirk. Congratulations <laughs> to our winners. Perfect. Will you please give those to Nancy? Thank you, ma'am. And I think is the next thing our juror winners? I believe so. Okay. Take it away. So... I have the winners right here. All of our artists this year had the option to participate in the juried portion of our competition. Our jurors this year were Jessica Hanlon, Glow Ramirez, and Donnie Gott. And during the past week, our jurors watched the live stream performance. They met with each of the artists over Zoom and reviewed the artist's wearable art 2021 piece portfolio. The jurors were looking at construction, innovation, and presentation. So. The 2021 winners of the Jurors Best of Show are Amy Dressel and Nick Dehart with their piece, So Long and Thanks for All the Fish. Woo!
And the juror's honorable mention goes to Stargazer by Katie Roop. Woohoo! Awesome job, artists. Those pieces were incredible. They were out of this world. We also gave our audience at home, will you step that way, my sweet child? Thank you. We also gave our audience at home a chance to vote on the Civil, Sybil Davis People's Choice Award, named after past Juno Arts Council Executive Director and founder of the Juno Wearable Arts Extravaganza, the Sybil Davis. This award gives our audiences at home a chance to vote for their favorite piece. This year, live stream ticket holders, living gallery ticket holders, and folks who purchased a ticket to the drive-in movie all were given the opportunity to vote. The winner of this year is artist Katie Roop and model, model Raya Waldern with Stargazer. Congratulations, Katie and Raya. All right, this is where it gets serious. <laughs> Our wearable art 2022 theme winner. This year, folks could vote with their dollars on our online auction homepage and the possible theme contenders were Legendary, Oceanic Overtures, and Reawakening. The theme that earned the most donations and will be the theme for next year will be Oceanic Overtures. Woo! Woo! Thank you everyone who donated to the themes. Kathleen? And I believe that is it for our winners for this year. Yes, thank you to everybody who donated. Great. Thank you to our all thank of our winners. Our team. Thank you to the team. Woo! Yeah. Good job. And thank you to everybody watching and we'll see you next year.